Hey, hi everybody. It's Angie, Treasured Vintage. Coming to you live on a Sunday. I have a haul from yard sales from um, my friend Michelle, who was a source of jewelry for me for a long time and just recently we connected again and uh, I got a few things from her too and I also got friend mail which I'm gonna wait and see if uh, Anitra and Cindy come on I spy Queens and I hope they come on Dawn hi Dawn I'm so glad you made the chat cool so yeah I got friend mail to show I got stuff from uh, yard sales I got vintage Christmas. I'm going to get into that first. Forgive me for the bag noise. Dawn, you'll probably like this stuff. Oh my gosh. Some really cute vintage Christmas stuff. Look at that. Isn't that adorable? Yeah, I'm glad you did. Isn't that cute? A little mouse, a little wood mouse. Totally vintage. Someone made that, right? The pipe cleaner tail. Got a whole bag of it. It was like a, I think it was like a quarter a piece. Or 50 cents a piece. But I think it was a quarter a piece. I know you will. Um, this one. Hi, Joanna. You watch my videos all the time and this is the first time on live chat. Yay! Well, thank you. It looks like Hong Kong. Okay. Okay, maybe it is. Um, okay, it's the, this one actually has one of those foil stickers. It says Taiwan. W-O-L-I-N. Taiwan on the back, on the bottom. So what's that date to? Like the uh, 70s maybe? Late 60s? Something. There's that guy. You've never seen a horse and cart one. And I have some other horse ones. Seven Bells. Hi. Thanks for coming. You guys, I should apologize for last week. Well, I'll do that later. Was it last week or two weeks ago? I don't even know. Gerald. Hi. There's my buddy Gerald. Look at that. So Christmassy. I love red and green. I always, I'm a sucker for red and green Christmas. Hi, Lydia. And I always put red and green. I always end up like, maybe I'll do white and silver this year. Or maybe I'll do something really different and fun like pink and purple. But I always end up with traditional red and green on my tree. I can't get away from it. I love red and green. It's just so Christmassy. So there's that one. And <laughs> this one's cute. There's this one. Isn't that cute? Hey, Diana. Good to see you. And there's this one. That's I guess that's the same. These two are almost the same. Got different hair. She's got fuzzy brown hair. And she's red and he's green. That's cute. Hip hop. Clippity cop. This one. You like the, they are cute, aren't they? And look, they have, he has little like fabric ears. And I'm, I'm probably gonna let, let these go on Etsy. Um, I'll see if, if they aren't going for much, then I will, I will keep them, but I'll probably, keep my favorite ones and let the rest of them go. There's a choo-choo guy. And there's a little um, truck guy. He's cute, that little Santa guy in there. Look at him. <laughs> He's cute. I got an angel. Angel flying on a horse. And what in the world? Uh-oh. Okay, he came off. 
There we go. And I probably will, um, Lydia, I'll probably put them on my Etsy. And I found a Jim Shore, which they're good sellers. Oh, they can? I thought so too, Dawn. Um, so, yeah, I'll probably put them. Would you sell them separate, Dawn? Or I'll have to look, um, see how they're doing separately as opposed to in a lot. Um, maybe I'll do a couple at a time, pair them up or something. It is uh, dazzledbyvintage.etsy.com, and I'll put it in the description um, when I'm done with the video, so you'll be able to see it there. Um, yeah, uh, Jim Shore is a bolo. His his ornaments do do well. They're they're good sellers. I pick his stuff up anytime I find it. You can usually tell by the kind of uh, folk art type painting on his. It's They always look the same. They always look kind of like that. Maybe in small lots. Okay. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. But, um, yeah, I got... He was marked too, but I, since I bought all that other stuff, I got him for a dollar. And... From my friend Michelle, who who has two booths at the, the antique market that I go to, um, and who I used to get a lot of jewelry from, I, I got some things from her. One thing sold already. Um, hi, Teresa. I can never find Jim Shore for a reasonable price. Hey, Jennifer. Yeah, I, I can't either, usually. I think people are on to the Jim Shore value now, and they're either priced up or you just can't find them because people scarf them up when they find them right away. So you have to tell me what you think about this. This is from my friend, uh, the jewelry source that I have, um, that I just told you about. Um, so I think this might be a, a bookmark. <laughs> But I'm thinking that the way people wear jewelry these days, that this could actually be worn like in a neck mess. Um, it's very, it's just cool. I, I don't know. You can, these, these crowns are so weighted um, that that will hang around your neck. Let me show you. I don't have the right outfit on it, but right now, but I'll show you. How it would be, and I, this is my neck mess today, but it's not going to match this. But it would actually hang like that without any problem, you know. And then you have your gold; you can have your gold neck mess here, and you know it's not going to go anywhere because those crowns are weighted. Um, you know, you could start a new trend. You could call that something. Uh, is that it's it's um mesh ribbon? It's fabric. And then the uh, crowns are really well made, um, metal, gold tone metal. It's almost like they're pendants, you know, put on there. Real blingy. I hope the picture's okay, and I hope you can hear me. I'm on my, using my iPad again because it's a little bit more convenient than my phone. So I hope you can hear me okay. I know the sound is a little muffled on the iPad it seems like but um yeah I start a new trend I'll just start it right now this is called this is called <laughs> uh, that is one thing I'm not good at I can't name it uh, pretty we can hear and see all oh, good okay so I have to I have to think on a name for this and it's going to be a new trend trending looks for 2020 fall 2020 Ta da <laughs> you saw it here first <laughs> and I got this on um, I think it was Mercari I got this it was different so I picked it up it it's color block gold tone locket in really nice condition um, that'll go with good with a, a neck mess Oh, it's a schmoogle. Ah, 
that is so right. That is so correct. You came with it, didn't you, Dawn? She came with the correct, correctness. <laughs> yeah, it's my neck schmoogle. It's the latest thing, the neck schmoogle. Okay, I got this. It's really nice, too. Schmoogles are all the rage. <laughs> Schmoogles. That sounds so, <laughs> so old-fashioned, Dawn. Schmoogles are, you can't say the bomb because that's like, that's like so, so 90s. What do you say these days? It's really, uh, I don't even know what you say. <laughs> it's definitely not like the cat's meow. That's, that's not good either. What is it? I don't know that I don't know the new terms anymore or at all or ever whatever but this is a beautiful rhinestone necklace in really nice shape I know there's probably a lot of these on uh, and I know there are a lot of them on Etsy but um this one's just really nice I don't think it's terribly vintage uh, but it is probably from the maybe 80s I don't know um, it's in really, really nice shape. What is great about this one? <laughs> slang, f you gave away your slang flashcards. <laughs> Are you serious? Was there, was it really a thing? Flash, slang flash cards. Um, I just have trouble remembering everyday words anymore, let alone trying to think about um, remembering or, or learning new slang stuff. <laughs> I can't even remember what words are to use anymore. But anyway, what I was saying, this is really nice because it has an extender on it. Look how long that extender is. And usually you don't find these with extender extenders on them. So that's what I like about this one. You legit had slanged cards. Well, that's it. That's the word maybe I was looking for. Like it's legit. It's This was like... This is legit Shmoogle. And I'm talking nonsense. I should stop that. Stop that and bring myself to the seriousness here. Um, what else did I get? I got this on my card too. Yeah, it's legit. I like that word. Um, this is really cute. This is like a... Kind of like a rose tone metal. Um, it's one of those pendants that folds out and it's like a locket but it comes apart. It's got like little wings on it. Little wings. Little wings open up. And then it all comes apart like that. Woo! And folds back together. And you fasten the wings back to it again. So it's like a little picture locket, I guess. It's not terribly old either. Um, you can just tell by the finish on it. It's it's pretty pretty new, I guess. But I love those kind of lockets that do that. Yeah. And then there's the, like holes there in the bottom that these little prongs fit into from the wings. And it just stays like that. So I got that. And I, I want to say this stuff was not more than... I don't think I paid any more than like $12 with shipping for this stuff I got from Macari. Although this one, this one I paid, I did pay $20 for this. This chain didn't come with it, but this is beautiful. This is a really nice sterling and turquoise pendant. Oh, you remember them. This is so, so pretty. I just, like, if I don't sell it, I'll keep it. I don't know yet, but it's really nice. Um, I love the design of it. It's kind of deco deco design you think that was worth twenty dollars I kind of do
And then this chain um, is sterling also, but I just bought the pendant, but I put this chain on it. This is a chain that came with another cool thing that I got from my friend. She charged me $5 for a whole bunch of stuff and at least 95 whoa. Um, this chain came with this sterling cross, which is beautiful. It's got onyx on it. It's old. It's marked. Well, no, it's not marked, but it is sterling, I'm pretty sure. And is Kathleen here? I think it is. There, Cindy. Hey. Hi. Where is Anitra? Is she here too? Got your box right open. Glenn's here. Hi, Glenn. How you doing? Oh, the turquoise one. Um, yeah, it's it's beautiful. I hope that I'll probably end up selling it. I don't know. Although it is, it's, I really like it. I do really, really like it. Yeah, it's sterling. It is sterling and turquoise, yes. And I'm pretty sure, even though this one's not marked, I, I'm pretty sure it is too. Um, I, I'm like almost positive. I don't know why it's not marked. It, it looks like, you know, artisan made. It looks fairly old to me with the stamp. Stamps. Um, I got this Monet pen. Cindy, is Anitra on here too? She should be on soon. Okay. All right. Thanks. And, um, I got this, um, I got this yesterday at a yard sale for 50 cents. It's sterling and garnet. It's a handmade um, bracelet with a toggle and a cross sterling it's marked sterling on it and it says believe and it's uh, Christian themed which I love so I might I might keep that for a while or forever <laughs> I don't know I have so much jewelry though my goodness I just have so so much did you ever hear of um Oh, gee. Hang on a second. Hi, Nitra. Did you ever hear of South Hill? This is a South Hill that I got from uh, Macari. And it's a locket with a that you can open up, and it has this little charm in it. I'm not going to open it up because my fingernails are about ready to come off anyway but you can take that out and put something different in it and it's gold tone so let me let me take a break from the haul and since both Cindy and Anitra are here I'm going to open the friend mail that they sent I Spy Queens sent me this friend mail I can't wait to see what's in it oh my goodness you guys are so great Thank you so much for caring to send me friend mail and you know it just it just makes you feel so good to get something and to know that your friends you know care enough to send you stuff and new friends at that I mean haven't been knowing you that long so thank you so so much yes friend mail Gerald sent me friend mail too oh looky here oh I love that. I love that. It's like a little surprise, the confetti in there. Cool. Here's the bag. It looks good. Oh man, I never get bags. I've never gotten like a jewelry bag, like from this store or anything. So this is exciting. I mean, they don't have that stuff around here. There was one time when my Goodwill had jewelry jars and I bought like nine of them at one time 
And that's the last time I think I ever got one. It's like one time from Goodwill. So this is really cool. Oh my gosh, stuff flying out on the floor. I think there's the M, the M words in here somewhere, oh, maybe. Oh, this is so pretty. I love this. Look at that. That pendant. I love that filigree work. That is so neat. I'm holding it wrong, but that is pretty. That'll be nice for a neck mess, for sure. Ooh, look at those pretty beads. Beautiful. That that could go on a necklace too. Necklaces are are just about my favorite. I think my favorites are necklaces and rings. Yeah, that's pretty. Hi, Kathleen. Hey, Miss Chris. Pretty. Those beads are really pretty. And is that 1928 or something? Ooh, it is. It's 1928. I love my 1928 stuff. Love, love, love. These beads are really pretty. Oh, man, that's a cute earring. Man, I love that. Let's see if I can find the other one. These are so cute. They're like fan shaped. Aren't they cute? These are neat. Fan, little fan shapes with the rhinestones in them. Man, you guys know my taste, don't you? Definitely know my taste. I think that's, there's something written in there, maybe. Not sure if that's signed or not. Oh, I think they're Avon because they have that little, anytime you see that little uh, square, Square with a round circle in it, a little tiny, tiny dot, round circle, square, Avon. So these are Avon. Um, these are Monet, I think. Does it say Monet around the post? I think it does. It probably does. Oh, no, it doesn't, but it could. Cause they're really nice i love them pearls real nice simple pearl cabochons beautiful a sunny pretty orange daisy love these some pretty pearls with the gold beads in between very nice Oh, a nice, um, icy looking chip necklace. That's really nice. It's cold. It's this, like, crystal chips or something. Nuggets. Oh, is BCP here? Cracky's here? Hi, Cracky. Thanks for coming. I missed you on my last one, I think. I wasn't on very long. Um, these are very cute. I love lever backs. They're so easy to wear, and these are very cute. I love the gun metal that just really fits with these earrings. Do you guys hear that chainsaw? They're cleaning up my neighbor's yard, which is a jungle, so I'm glad they're doing that. Oh, this is really cute. I love this. Wow, this is cute. This looks like Avon too, maybe. Pretty sure it is. Um, this is, you can hear it, but you have headphones. <laughs> That's cute. It's got the little, um, Freshwater pearls or seed pearls like. Really pretty. I love that design. That's cute. 
I love all this stuff, you guys. Oh, this is neat. Statement. Oh, this is neat. I will wear this with my silver neck messes. This is neat. I love these kind of ne necklaces. So different and with the dingle dangles. You can hear music. Wow. <laughs> I don't hear any music, but that is cool. Man, I love that. That's neat. That's me. Yeah, that's cool. Thank you. This is, looks like a Coro or something, maybe a Coro or a listener. Older necklace from the 50s. Coro. Yep. Really nice finish. It's funny how they have that uh, different looking light color finish in the 50s and 60s. I do, Cindy, so much. Thank you so, so much. Oh, look at these. These are pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Look at those. Like wearing a little uh, bouquet of flowers on your ears. These are dear. I love colorful things, too. Those are cute. They're pierced. Cute. This is so nice of you guys. Oh, really pretty Liz Claiborne um, earrings. They're nice quality. Oh, you guys are so generous. You could have sold these and made out well on these. And instead, you sent them to me. Just the kind of girls you are. Lovely peoples. Oh, look at this. This is cute. Oh, that's really neat. That's a nice uh, reindeer for like Christmas, right? Christmas. That's neat. Look how good that looks. I like that kind of stuff. I might have to wear that. Oh, I don't deserve it. <laughs> I don't deserve it. You deserve to get some friend mail is what it is. Oh, that's cute. A little bell. Oops. A little Christmas bell. One of those kind of the pinch back thing on it. See, we got a, a magnet. I, I thought that would be a pin, but that's cool that it's a magnet. That's pretty. I'd almost like to have the magnet more than the pin because you see all, you see a lot of the pins, but I've never seen a magnet, so... That brooch was Coro too, was it? That, uh, the reindeer? You have that one, Lydia? Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. And I think here's this. This is a cute little um, hat, little Western hat like. A little cowboy, cowgirl hat with a the pinchback thing on it too and here's something that's in oh this is beautiful this is in a baggie this is really pretty i got some other stuff in baggies too oh there's another baggie of stuff oh feels so special feels so loved mm, this is Ooh, man, that would just go with what I'm wearing today. Navy blue. That would go good with this neck mess, actually. That would go good. And it has a tag on it, and it says... Whoa. I think it's White House Black Market. Yeah, W-H-B-M is White House Black Market. A 
with spec tag WH BM White House Black Market. Um, but that's actually blue in there. So that is nice. I really like that. Some of the stuff I'm definitely going to be wearing. <laughs> definitely going to be wearing some of this like soon oh this is neat these are glass glass beads and probably somebody made this um, maybe somebody made it it's got a, a lobster claw clasp and then it has these these to go with it oh it says it's agate it says agate okay Yellow agate. Nice. Nice. That's a nice color for fall. Very nice. Oh, that's different. That's cool. That's cool, too. It's like a... Oops. It's like a... Um, really modernist type of a bracelet with the little circles on with the it's almost like abalone um i'm not sure if it is abalone or not but it's got that look to it it's iridescent sorry if i'm missing any comments i'm just enthralled here with the jewelry Let's see is there anything else did i miss anything did I miss anything, you guys? I think I got everything. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so, so much. I cannot believe how kind you guys are. Thank you. I wish that I could give you a big, giant hug. And hi, Charlene. How are you? Thanks for coming. I don't believe I saw you before, but thanks for coming. Yeah, I wish I could give... Oh, my gosh. I wish I could give you a hug. But thank you. I love everything. Yeah, it was great mail. That really made my day. Did you say something about a card? What'd you say? Oh, okay. Here's a card. Oh, okay. Do you want me to read it or not? Oh. Oh. Oh, thanks. That's nice. Long distance hug. Yeah. It'd be so great to, um, okay. Thank you. I, I appreciate so much what you said in here and, uh, I'm doing better, doing better this week. So it's great. Um, there hug. Oh, Kathleen, that would feel so good from you. I can just feel that now. I know you give good hugs. I just know it. Um, Oh, what was I saying? What was I saying? I don't know. Oh, how how neat it would be, like for for to have a big meet up and meet everybody. That would be so cool, just to be able to. You know, in a in a world that doesn't have stupid Corona, you know, meet everybody and hug everybody and everything. Oh, you asked your grandson. I'm sure he'd say you have good hugs. Yep. Okay, I'm, I have a few more things in the haul that I want to show you that I got at yard sales. I did get some gold. Oh my goodness, that's loud. I'm going to have to yell. I got gold for 50 cents. This is 14 karat gold. It's a charm. <laughs> oh, you come and bring Carol. Oh, yeah. Where is Carol? She's usually here. Yeah, so that was a nice little find for 50 cents. Gold. This is uh, from my friend Michelle. It was one of the things that I got. Um, I really like this. This is, I'm going to keep. Um, it's old. Um, it's like that kind of marbled look inside. I don't know if the light's very good, but... I have a feeling there'll be all kinds of shadows if I turn the light on, so. You see that marbled look, that old marbled look in there? It's kind of lucite, I guess. Um, but, yeah, this is, that's a keeper. I'm keeping that. I like it. 
so that's mine. She's off doing shenanigans. <laughs> or she's hiding because you're here. <laughs> yeah, right. Maybe she fell in the bin. Maybe that's what happened. Ooh, this is nice. This was a dollar. This is a nice big sparkly rhinestone pin. Look at the big giant rhinestones in there. I like it because it's got, you know, you don't often see those big rhinestones. And uh, it's nicely constructed with the riveted construction, the rivets on the back. Um, this is something that I got at the same time I got this from the same seller on Macari. Um, these are neat. These are um, nice big hoops. They're going to go in my Etsy shop. Um, cool design on them, kind of like a Harley Quinn design, and um, they're nice and thick, and nice and big, and these will sell. Those will sell. And then I got some Napier, little Napier earrings for 50 cents. They're very cute. And this little thing, I might, it's, it's like an artisan pin. I might take it apart and use some of the charms for like my neck messes. I don't know. Um, if you were back, sorry. Oh, okay. I'm gonna. I might not be here when you get back, Anitra. But thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I'm. I'm gonna probably leave in another minute. So. Um, this is Monet. Did I show you? That? I think I already showed you that. That's Monet. And I have one necklace left, and then I'm gonna go. This is going to be a short one today. Um, this is was one of the things I got from my friend Michelle. It's a really nice necklace with these uh, diamond-shaped filigree stations. She might be lurking. Wow, she should not lurk. She'd say hi. She wouldn't lurk with me. She'd say hi. I knew she would. So this is this is a nice necklace too. I'm going to probably put that in my Etsy shop. She wouldn't lurk on me, BCP. Carol don't do, the, do me that way. <laughs> All right. I'm going to go. Um, just a short one today. Oh, I forgot this. I got this. Cool. Kathleen, you'll like this. Wood jewelry. Kathleen. Carol, you rotten lurker, you. <laughs> I'll be right back. I want to show something. Kathleen's still here. I got to show you Kathleen something. She's still here? Okay. She, Kathleen likes wood jewelry. This is my wood jewelry. And then I, then I got this. This is all my wood jewelry. <laughs> I put it all in this jar. Look. Look at all that. Funny name, bum, bum crack picker. Yeah, isn't it, isn't it, Charlene? Isn't that cool? Yeah, I know. I'm, and some of the stuff is so neat. I mean, some of the stuff is really cool. You know, that, this, I mean, it's just, it's just so, got earrings, really cool necklaces, I mean, I don't know what it's doing in there, other than, I guess I'm collecting it, <laughs> I don't know, um, all right, I just wanted to show you that, Kathleen, um, I'm going to go. Thank you so, so much for the friend mail. Thank you to my subscribers. I appreciate every one of you. Thank you for watching and coming back. Yeah, it's nice to see you too, Gerald. You have a great week too. And uh, thanks, Cindy. You too. And, and really nice to see you here, Charlene. Thanks for coming. Thanks for all the new people that watch, all the old people. Um, God bless you all. I mean that from the bottom of my heart. I hope that God just showers his blessings on you today. And I will see you the next time. Bye.